If you're gonna do it, really fucking do it. All right. So. Vortex. I just had uh, lunch with my church family. Why is it so hard to do things like that? It's like I find myself studying everybody. Which I guess is cool. You know, like I'm never bored because there's always potential to study everything. And I can always just look around and make assessments about my environment. So it's like I'm making myself laugh or I'm coming up with all kinds of information that's truly captivating, you know? I think that most people are like that though. Most people want to be told what to do. They want to be told what to care about. They want to be told what's funny. They want to be told what they're allowed to laugh at. And those people are lame and should just commit suicide. But they won't because they don't have any self-awareness. And so... I know I talk about that a lot. Like how more people have self-awareness, they don't commit suicide. It's true. Well, if they had awareness in general. Because with self-awareness comes world awareness. And that world awareness is really, really depressing. Which is why it's very important to be good with yourself. Because if you're good with yourself, all this other stuff... I'm not going to say it doesn't bother you at all, but it won't bother you as much. Because... The kinds of people that wind up a storm, or the kinds of people that are just like pissed off that things are messed up, yeah, things have always been messed up. Maybe if you had empathy, you would be able to see that. But, yeah, I mean, things are always messed up. Because we live in a world that's run by Satan. Love is a verb, not an action. No, no, that's not what it said. It said love... <laughs> You fucked that up. Yeah, we just saw a church billboard that said, love is a verb. <laughs> it's an action, not a feeling. That's true. It's very, very true. And that's why it's important to have church billboards. Especially if there's not anything good going on at the church, you know, at least you have a billboard that's decent that can make people think. station. I'm sure gas prices are going to skyrocket. If they seem like they're going down, it's just to fuck with your head, okay? They're going to keep screwing us. It's like everything 
is designed to control us. So like our whole society, the way that everything is set up, it's designed to make us trust everything but God. So we, we trust the way that we've been programmed. You know, things that we've been taught about our country, things that we've been taught about history, okay? It's so crazy to me, like, how people are so shocked by evil in this world. This is why I call being schizophrenic, like, a privilege. Because when, when you have schizophrenia, you know that the world is bad. That's why you don't trust it. You know that doctors and nurses are not helping the public. Because they don't know how. Because they weren't taught that in medical school. They were only taught how to drug people, okay? And just to let you know, if you're a nurse or a doctor, fuck you. That's exactly what people think about you. Except the people that actually trust your dumbass. I know, I sound really arrogant right now. <laughs> Ignorant and arrogant. <laughs> it's true, I know. They're authority figures. Why would you ever trust an authority figure? I mean, seriously, it is a privilege to be this paranoid about society. And I'm not scared about what they're going to do. I'm scared what God's going to do. I'm scared for all the ways that they're going to be punished for an entire eternity. Okay? That's really going to suck. That's going to suck way more than anything this government does. So... Marinate.